Surging Sparks isn't even out in English, although there has been some people opening it. I don't know how they got it early. Good for them. But anyways, <laughs> I'm a little salty. Um, but we have some news about the next upcoming Pokemon set, which is an Eevee set. And we got some news. We got some cards revealed, and we're going to jump into all of that right now. Um, so this is all from Pokebeach.com. And they're saying that the Eevee EX has just been revealed um, from Terrastal Festival, uh, which is part of the Japanese set that's going to make our English set. This is supposed to come out on December 6th. And we have a look at the Eevee card with the crown, right? So this is just the EX. So this is supposed to be an Eeveelution set. Um, we've known about this for quite a while now. Um, and it'll be very interesting to see what cards we end up getting from this. Um, so it looks like, um, and we even got some pack art here. Uh, so super cool. Obviously we got Eeveelutions on here. We got the Umbreon, we got the Glaceon, uh, Terrapagos, and uh, Teal Mask. So honestly, like, I don't know what to expect. So this is supposed to be um, a specialty set. So Terrastal Festival will be featured in the English set Prismatic Evolution. So this comes out in English on January 17th. They're also reporting that, so Prismatic Evolution will be comprised of uh, the Terrastal Festival and the EX Starter Deck Generations, which we actually have some news from that as well. So this is uh, the EX Starter Deck Generations. Um, they talked about this, we've known about this for a while, like, so in April, um, but this is what we're seeing. These are the decks, and so I think they're going to take these cards, combine with the other set, and make our English set. Um, we got Pikachu and Snorlax being featured here. We got Tyranitar and Lugia. I mean, look at these. Some of these look pretty cool. Um, Mimikyu here, like, right? So these are... This is the box and everything, so this is what we're seeing. So um, we also have some full cards that have been revealed. We'll take a look at all of those as well. Um, we'll see. So some of these are, looks like some of these are familiar cards. Um, and some of them might be new. But um, Oddish, Gloom, Bioplume, Pinsir. So we don't have any of the like secret rares, but we're getting a look at some EXs here. Torchic, Reshiram, pretty cool. Got a nice slow poke. Kyogre, it's a cool Pikachu. And then even some evolutions in the in the starter decks. Xerneas, Mimikyu. So with this set. Some people, I mean, there's some rumors floating around that they're saying this is going to be the next Evolving Skies because it's Evolutions. Um, I wouldn't go that far yet. We, we got to see more, a lot more. Um, also, there is the interesting um, aspect. This is adorable Eevee. Snorlax, um, Lugia. The interesting aspect, in my opinion, is there's kind of been a lot of hate around the crown mechanic and obviously the EV that we saw earlier has the crown so what are people where are people really going to be at when this set releases i hear way more that people dislike the crowns than people like them um you gotta understand that it's probably a certain uh collector or investor type that mainly is watching the content not the average uh just collector but so i don't know how accurate that is but um then we got i don't know what this is even saying this is just i like this artwork here super adorable um these are just some artworks for the for the decks which are cool honestly this is really cool blaziken with the kyogre that's cool Ooh, okay i like that i like these artworks that we're getting I, what, what is this what is this why are they together that's weird um, yeah, so this artwork is super cool. I'm digging it. So, yeah, so that's pretty much it for the news that we have for now. This is going to be a shorter video. Um, but I did want to talk about, um, kind of 
I don't like diving a little bit more into the set. Well, one, we don't really know. We hardly know anything, to be honest. We've seen pretty much just the basic cards and a few EXs, like the Eevee. And I uh, honestly, currently, I, I'm not really that hyped for this set. Personally, not that it can't be great, but I just think I need we need to see more. Um, I don't know. Sometimes, sometimes specialty sets are. I think more often than not, specialty sets kind of. Well, I feel like they're not always that good. There's always exceptions. Obviously, like 151 Crown Zenith, a uh, more recent um, Paldean Fates is pretty good too. But it's not like they're usually not like bangers. I feel. Um, I mean, then you get like. Shrouded Fable, which obviously um, kind of flopped, but um, yeah, so I just, I, I don't really know what to expect. I'm trying to temper expectations. I am not thinking Evolving Skies 2.0, even though uh, it looks like Umbreon is going to be featured in here, but we don't know, we don't know what cards we're going to get. That doesn't mean we're going to get a secret illustration rare of uh, Umbreon. Uh, it's, it seems like it might be likely, but also one thing that you guys need to consider is Usually the pull rates for these specialty sets are not as difficult, so we may be looking at, um, even if we get some cool cards, um, they might not be that hard to pull. So uh, as far as like having Evolving Skies 2.0, um, you know, it's we, Evolving Skies has like brutal, brutal pull rates, and this probably won't have that um, as a specialty set. So anyways, um, that's pretty much going to do it for this one. I just wanted to touch on... Uh, talk, talk about what we know about the set and just kind of give my overall impressions. Um, yeah, so that, that's pretty much it. Um, that's going to do it for this one, guys. I'll catch you in the next one. And remember, it was never a phase.